I eat words for breakfast. The only time I can taste words is when I speak ones that have been written. Thought flavors them like salt, and they are yummy. Even yummy sounds yummy. Fuck cellar door. Cellar door has no fucking idea in it. I don't want to eat cellar door. But yummy? I can chew on yummy. I like to see what happens to words that have ideas in them. Listen to how they feel. Feel how they taste. Suck on them and roll them around in my mouth. There is some depth in those. Filled only halfway and daring you to guess if they're half full or half empty and daring you to finish filling them yourself. While each stroke of sound pulled into the air is melting like sugar in iced tea. Especially poetry, where meanings seep through words that are only the vehicle for their expression. There are different kinds of tea, you know. So we don't have to wonder where meaning resides, because it pervades through us, through every word. Those words taste like cotton candy in my mouth. A split second, and they have gone into my tongue. Then I'm sure I can still taste them, even after I stop eating. Then I think I'm okay, but then I get a sugar rush. This melting is like how when, I, when you see a really good movie in the theater, and when the movie is over, everyone gets up and leaves right away. And... I think they're all stark, raving mad every time, every time I see a movie because I need to sit and absorb the light sound transformation that just happened before my eyes like butter into popcorn. And more importantly, the ideas conveyed therein. Those last longer than the popcorn smell stuck to my clothes. Words are so powerful, in fact, that we invented the idea of magic spells that control the uncontrollable with pre-thought speech. And is it a coincidence that spells are so close to how we spell a word? Spell it. Spell it out. Spill your words out. It's got something to do with stitching words together. It seems so taken for granted, but the pattern works so well. Words do so much because we do so much by words, with words, because of words. They must be magic. I eat words with my eyes when I read them. I eat words with my pen when I write them. I eat words so fast I choke sometimes when I type them. I eat words with my soul when I write poetry. Someone recites to me and, did you like that poem? All I can say is marshmallows. <laughs>